Hello and welcome and today I'm going to be showing you how to share your laptop's internet or computer's internet with your Xbox. Now in simpler term, it's basically using your laptop slash computer as a wireless adapter for your Xbox. Now obviously um, I have an old Xbox here which I don't have a wireless adapter so I'm going to be using this method called ICS and what that stands for? Internet Connection Sharing. So first of all, you have to set up some things on your laptop, so I'm just going to kind of like move it away here and zoom in. This camera zooms in quite slow, so I'll just zoom it in there. As you can see, I've got two wireless connections. One, which is local area connection, and that is the Ethernet, and the wireless network connection. So what I want to do is what we want to right click on network connection, wireless network connection and click properties and then go on the sharings tab and then turn on allow other network to connect through this computer's internet connection and also you have to turn that on as well allow network users to control and disable the internet connection <laughs> I've got a bit of bad hay fever so I mind my sniffing and coughing so once you tick this just click OK it should take quite a while and your laptop is now prepared and done so now it's to the Xbox. So yeah, that's my game. So if you want to add me, then add me. I might not accept, but you know. But besides that, what you want to do is you want to move to system settings. I'll move the camera towards the screen so it's get a better angle. There we go. Now you want to go on uh, network settings, and as you can see, there's wide network. Now, what you want to do. It's now plug the Ethernet cable behind your Xbox to your laptop. So, as you can see, there's my Ethernet cable from the um, Xbox. Now I'm just going to plug it to my laptop. Make sure you are connected to your wireless connection. So I'm just going to move the laptop here. Just plug it in, just like that. There should be a tick on the Xbox screen, as you can see. And local area connection, it says unidentified network network but that's alright everything's working so I'm just going to close my laptop screen here now on the Xbox what you want to click on is obviously wired network and then before we even test the Xbox network or Xbox live connection we want to configure this so go on configure go on to additional settings and press restore factory defaults click yes as you can see it's all not set now it's done automatic now go back and now you can test the Xbox Live connection. Click yes, it will sign you out. Now if this message comes up saying test failed, you can restart your Xbox. Since this has uh, happened to me, so the first time when I've done it, it says fail test, so I'm just going to restart the Xbox. Now as you can see, once you restarted the Xbox, it said that I am signed in to Xbox Live. Which means now, you have set up your laptop to share the internet to your Xbox. So as you can see, everything is now cool and working. And as you can see, all my, here's my all my Xbox Live stuff. And as, as you can see, I am indeed signed in. So you can see, so yeah. This is pretty much it, so um, thanks for watching. And as always, please subscribe, comment and more videos will be coming soon.